chapter 23 and sara was an 107 and 20 years old these were the years of the life of sara and sara died in kirshat arba and the same is hebron in the land of canaan and abraham came to mourn for sara and to weep for her and abraham stood up from before his dead and spake unto the sons of heth saying i am a stranger and a sojourner with you give me a possession of a burying place with you that i may bury my dead out of my sight and the children of heth answered abraham saying unto him hear us my lord thou art a mighty prince among us in the choice of our speculators bury thy dead none of us shall withhold from thee his sepulcher but that thou mayest bury thy dead and abraham stood up and bowed himself to the people of the land even to the children of heth and he communed with them saying if it be your mind that i should bury my dead out of my sight hear me and entreat for me to ephron the son of sohar that he may give me the cave of mikpelak which he had which is in the end of his field for as much money as it is worth he shall give it me for a possession of a burying place amongst you and ephron dwelt among the children of heth and ephron the hittite answered abraham in the audience of the children of heth even of all that went in at the gate of his city saying nay my lord hear me the field give i thee and the cave that is therein i give it thee in the presence of the sons of my people give it thee bury thy dead and abraham bowed down himself before the people of the land and he spake unto ephron in the audience of the people of the land saying but if thou wilt give it i pray thee hear me i will give thee money for the field take it of me and i will bury my dead there and ephron answered abraham saying unto him my lord hearken unto me the land is worth 400 shekels of silver what is that betwixt me and thee bury therefore thy dead and abraham hearkened unto ephron and abraham weighed to ephron the silver which he had named in the audience of the sons of heth 400 shekels of silver current money with the merchant and the field of ephron which was in mikpela which was before mamre the field and the cave which was therein and all the trees that were in the field and where in all the borders round about were under share and abraham for a possession in the presence of the children of heth before all that went in at the gate of his city and after this abraham buried sara his wife in the cave of the field of mekbela before mamre the same is hebron in the land of canaan and the field and the cave that is therein were made share unto abraham for a possession of a burying place by the sons of heth